connected from 194 applications here. So being here this week and conducting with Hong Kong Symphonietta is already a great reward and prize in itself. So, Every one of you is a very strong personality and everybody is very different and you are absolutely and unique in the world. There is no copy of you. So this is the important thing now that everyone develops his own style and life and we wish you the very, very best for everyone. For the future, I hope to see you again and hopefully often on stage somewhere in the world. Just the thought about being a conductor. I think what we have to remind, or we should remind ourselves always again, that conducting is not for the conductor. Um, it's much more for the orchestra, for the audience, and last not least, for the music. If we imagine going on stage as a conductor without any orchestra, I don't think how much audience we would have at the end of the concert. So, uh, the conductor, in a way, I think is not really important. Um, and we have this amazing privilege um, to live with music every day in our world which is getting more and more complicated from day to day. Music is one of the great remaining values, the, one of the greatest things mankind has to offer. And we can call it our profession that we can deal with this every day. And uh, sometimes I think the music is something like I would say, I call it the spiritual nutrition, which we really need. And um, we, I mean, when we compare, um, let's say the composer is the cook for this nutrition, and we are the conductor and also the musicians on stage, even. Um, we are only, let's say, the waiters who bring the music to the table of our listeners. So let's stay very modest and always step back behind the music. And in this sense, I wish you the very best, and maybe some of you are young enough to see you again at the next Hong Kong International Conducting Competition, which will take place in four years, 2027. But uh, now, to your Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Christoph, for your wonderful speech. Uh, you've said it all, so I will make it very brief. I don't have much else, uh, much more to add on. Um, there's only one thing. Um, a lot of people ask me what are the qualities of a good conductor. So for all of you who have attended our various rounds of competition, I'm sure you have noticed these qualities already. And they, they were exhibited through our 16 candidates, they all have these special qualities, good technique, um, great musicianship, good leadership, and the connection, communication with the orchestra and with the audience. And uh, there are many more. There's one thing I think um, maybe you would like to know is for a conductor, we must be able to multitask. You've got to think of the music before everybody else, and then you've got to show it to the audience, uh, to the orchestra, and then you've got to respond to what the orchestra sound, and then make adjustment accordingly. So you are probably thinking of at least four or five different things at the same time. So um, it's not easy at all. But I thank you all, all 16 of you, who did such a remarkable job and showing us what a real conductor should be. And um, some of you have more experience than others, and you have probably have more advantage in that sense. But I can see in those of you who are the younger ones, the potential that you showed us. And um, if you win the Price today, that's great. If you don't have any price today, that's not the end of the world because you still have a long way to go. And I'm sure next time when you do another competition or audition, 
Um, you would have learned from your previous experience and I'm sure you will do even better. So uh, don't be disappointed and uh, there's always hope and keep working and um, don't give, us, uh, give up what you have devoted your time and your energy into. Um, so, and also I hope you have made more friends and more connection among yourself. And um, exactly like what Maestro Liu and I uh, had gone through, we met each other back in the 80s at university and in competition. And we've remained good friends and good colleagues. So I'm sure in the years to come, you will have that kind of relationship and help each other. So thank you very much.